um, the locker room was really like just heads down, uh, really mopey, depressed. I mean, we just we lost a lost a tough game to a good team, and uh, just just people trying to console people. I mean, and uh, coach finally calling us back. Uh, so he can so, so he can say his speech and just say we have to. I mean, don't forget about this loss, but we got to just move on to the next opponent. That's Boise, and that's what we did. Uh, just gone to plane, really thought about it. Got back here. Some of us got in the gym, put up some shots, and just really just started focusing on Boise State on Wednesday for tomorrow. Yeah, we just just went to the gym and just got some shots. I mean, playing a game like that, just have to just wanted to get back in the gym, just get my shot right. Nah, I just retweaked it in the Air Force game, but it's fine. I'm good now. Everything is good. Does it bother you still at all? Nah, it doesn't bother me at all. Just staying focused. Um, we don't really like to take back-to-back -back losses. We we haven't had it had back-to-back -back losses in I don't think forever. But after we lose one, you just got to go hard, hit the lab again, forget about it, but still remember that loss. So you make sure you don't get take another loss. Uh, I mean, they're, they're an attacking team. I mean, they have great shooters uh, and just great drivers, and they really like to get up the floor. And uh, when they get in the half court, they like to drive. Uh, the drivers like to drive, and they're like, they get all the way to the rim. They'll get to the rim, and if not, they'll kick it out to the shooters. And they're they're when the shooters are letting it go, and they just they just play hard. I mean, you're just gonna have to match match their intensity. How dangerous is the plan to see just one year? Uh, it's, it's very dangerous. I mean, uh, they don't really have nothing to lose. Just coming out here, just they're just gonna come out and play their hardest. I mean, so and they're just that more hungry for a win and that more motivated. So. Uh, and that's what that's what happened to us against Colorado State coming off them coming off two two uh big losses and us having them at their home. I mean they're just more hungry and more motivated. And uh I think we all came together and I don't think that's gonna happen happen again with this for us. Chase, what's to say about your program that when you go on the road now and you lose like Colorado State, the fans rush the court. Uh huh. Yeah, I mean, just seeing just seeing that, just just it's just crazy. I mean, it happened to us to, to them last year when we won our little, when we won our league, and it happened when we lost to BYU uh, last year. But it's just it's hard it's hard to to see that. I mean, walking off the court, everybody rushing the court, but it's, it shows uh, what kind of what kind of program we have, and how far we came. I mean, usually we're the we're the team that's doing that, and to see that happen uh, to us, to see how far we've came. Uh, just a bigger role. I'm starting to get uh, more minutes, but uh, it's it's just same thing. We just want to win. I mean, if it takes me coming off the bench, <laughs> I'm gonna come off the bench. But if it takes me starting, then I'm gonna start. But that's pretty much it. And Coach Fish has uh, stepped my my role up in it by being a starter. I guess he filled out my bigger role starting than off the bench, but. If it takes me coming off the bench again, I'll come off the bench again. If it takes me starting, it takes me starting. I just want to win. He was talking about your rebounds. Now, if, if you're playing <coughs> closer to the basket now, is, is, how has that changed? <laughs> uh, it changed things a lot for me. When I signed my learn 10, I would expect <laughs> I would be playing post and doing jump ball. But like I said, I just want to win. So whatever it takes me to do, I'll guard a seven-footer. If I have to guard a seven-footer, if it takes us to win. I mean, we joke we joke about it all the time. <laughs> you say, bro, you're you're a post now, but uh, man, he's just 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 Jamal. Like he said, he just wants to win. He'll do any, <laughs> anything and everything for that. So if he has to play the five and the four, he's gonna play the five and the four, and that's what that's what I love about him. He's just a warrior. I go to Big Mario. 
I eat the mushroom at home, and I <laughs> go to Big Mario, super size me. Awesome. Uh, just, yeah, they, just, they just give us great energy when we get out there and play, and you know they just gotta keep coming out and supporting us. Uh, I just just like it. They're really like a show. I mean, got all the posters, the little antics. I mean, before the game, they they're right there with us and start start shooting around. I mean, it's just 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 love, just a beautiful thing to watch. And they added the little the little black little little uh, tarp blanket tarp, tarp. tarp thing. Yeah, yeah, it's just makes them more, way more liver. So yeah, they're adding more and more things each and every game. That's to what I see.